Portland's Old Port had water levels on Saturday that had never been seen before in the city. The tide reaching Commercial Street before slowly receding. Some debris lingered today, but business owners want people to know they're open and serving folks while continuing to assess damage and plan for storms in the future. It was a long weekend, a lot of hours, a lot of cleanup and a lot of waiting. It was a historic weekend. Uh, there's not a lot you can do when tide comes in like that. And we had to do a lot of waiting, hoping and a lot of cleanup. My concern is the future. I mean, is this going to be, you know, are we going to be seeing this on a regular basis? So that's pretty scary. Um, but our crew did great. You know, we just we handled it the best we could. Also, once the governor announced a state of civil emergency, it triggered a statute in Portland requiring employees to be paid at least one and a half times the minimum wage, bringing it to $22.50 an hour. Responses so far have been mixed from Old Port businesses. Some told us they had planned for the added wages and were happy to help employees right now, while others said this is hurting businesses that are also paying for repairs right now. And there's no more hazard to necessitate rather hazard pay.